Hey everyone, it's Bonnie. Happy Monday night. I am back. I am going to do a demo of the Bath and Body Works Firecracker Pop Bath Fizzy. All that is left is the shell because I just put this in my sink. Now, I'm typically not a fan of the Bath and Body Works Bath Fizzies only because they're a little bit more like Alka-Seltzer. I always use the Lush ones because they're a lot creamier. However, a lot of people do like this formula. What's interesting about this one is I like this one a little bit better, I think, um, than some of the other ones I've used because it's not really strong. I was expecting a really potent tart cherry scent. I can barely smell this on my hand. I was actually really surprised at how light it was, which I kind of liked because sometimes the Bath and Body Works ones can be a little bit overwhelming. But what these do, these are super fast fizzer and um, there's like a little bit of oil in the water. So I'm actually going to go through, I'm going to keep the sound on so you can hear the fizz because it's really interesting and I will be back at the end. It, the firecracker pop bath fizzy oh my gosh it's perfect for fourth of july <laughs> the water is super blue there's a little bit of oil in the water actually this one did not feel as oily as the majority of them do it felt actually pretty nice on my skin um after i took my hand out it didn't feel oily it just felt like my skin was really moisturized so i think i would actually use this one in the bathtub i actually liked it it wasn't bad. The water turned a beautiful blue. I swear there were a couple little um, sparklies in there. I don't know if I was just imagining things or not, but it seemed like there was like a shimmery uh, sparkling effect, but not bad. So I don't know. Let me know what you guys think of the bath fizzy. I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.